if you're a federal organization where you have real-time streams of data, you can actually take Tableau, visualize those streams of data in real time, and actually make decisions that can save lives. Whenever we give our information out to the government, they can actually take that information and share it with allies, they can share it with other governments, or even share it within, uh, between levels of our own government. So we connect to the server, we pull the data, we have it all at our fingertips, and then we can really just start tearing into it. So one of the questions that I had is, how do we decide which terrorist groups are the most effective? And what I thought of is actually video games. I'm a big gamer, I'm an avid gamer. And so to me, ratios like kill to death ratio means a lot. And I got to thinking, well, could we apply those same ratios to terrorist groups? What we found was is that some groups were actually extremely effective. Whenever a bomb goes off carried out by the Taliban, they're killing three people for every one person that they're losing. Other groups, like lashkar e taiba are even more effective than that. The difference being is they're not able to carry out that sustained level of operation as long as the Taliban have. So we were able to find out that the Taliban were actually extremely effective at causing casualties while not sustaining them over a long period of time. We then briefed these findings to the National Counterterrorism Center at their annual, annual conference. Before we started using Tableau, we were very top-down in how we did our analysis. And what I mean by that is there was basically three people in the organization who could do it. Now I have a team of 10 people who are all trained in Tableau desktop who can produce dashboards, create reports, and we have a turnaround time of instead of about a week or more, we can actually do a fill a request for information in about a day. Teaching people is fun. Querying data is terrible. And if you can do it in a product that takes 15 minutes to query the information visually, then you can actually start enjoying life again.